Hey guys, happy quarantine 2021. <laughs> Can you guys believe we're still in this? We are in quarantine and not doing shit, so things have gotten a little better and I'm able to finally go get these eyebrows done. Oh my god, they look terrible on camera. Fuck. Oh, pardon my laundry in the back. Uh, I'm getting my eyebrows done today by Kelly Baker. She is a celebrity eyebrow enthusiast. This is her bathroom. She's taking a phone call, so I decided to just film my intro right now. These are all the new Hollywood brows, and these are all the people that she's done. Like, get it in. Kim, Zendaya, Shane Mitchell, Ariana Grande, Khloe Kardashian, Kourtney Kardashian. Wow. What an honor. But Taylor, these are the old Hollywood brows, but these are the new starlets. It's really dope. I love that. So I'm here with none other than the Kelly Baker brows. Hey! Who she is going to bless me with some of her magic because I literally let these go through in quarantine and... It's been way too long. It's way too long. Let's get our wax on. Yes. Because otherwise it's too high. Can you see it? Yeah, then you're on the lap. Okay. So the way that your brows grow, mm -hmm. but what it shows like to our eye is this part is super super thin, mm -hmm. right underneath here, mm -hmm. and the the hairs are far apart. So if I take that off, it makes it too high. Mm -hmm. We're gonna keep it so you, it connects all the way across to where the arch is. Nice. So we're gonna fill this in with powder or pencil. Mm -hmm. Same thing on this side. So the girth of your brow is here. So it needs to connect like that, mm -hmm. which is why we're leaving these hairs here. This cannot be higher than this part of the brow. Mm -hmm. Just see how it goes, it slants down. Right. It needs to go up. Oh. Take a tiny little bit more. My what? My poor tree that no one got to see. Oh, wow. They look so good. So the inner part is where it's tricky in right, here right. because that's where you have the hairs that are sparse but everything else is connected. You know what I mean? Yeah. They look good though. 
I don't think we should take that out. You can just leave it and, and cover it with the highlighter to make it look higher. Does that make sense? Yeah. That's actually what I do with mine. If you look at mine, you can see I do the same thing. I try to hide it. Mm -hmm. Because otherwise it just makes it too thin. Yeah, true. No, you're right. You know what I mean? And then that'll yeah. look too done, but like over styled. Yeah, because... Do you see that? Yeah. So, everything comes in three three shades. Blonde, brown, brown, dark brown. Mm -hmm. Okay. We use the brown on you. Brown is basically everyone. Almost. Oh, okay. okay. It looks light. It looks ashy, but they're baked. They're pigmented. Super pigmented. So, a little goes a long way. If you want to make it darker, you just wet the brush and you can make it more sharp. Wow. But your go-to is always going to be this brown color. So it's lit and the blonde is good for... It's for the blondes. Yes. But the dark brown also too, if you ever do any male grooming, you can put it also in their beard. In the beard. Mm. Okay. And, and, or, and, and their, and their mustache. And they love it. Same thing for the, for the tinted gels. It comes in blonde, brown, and dark brown. Blonde. Look how dark the blonde is. So this is a stain. So if anyone... That's blonde. Oh, so you can use me. this by itself and see how I'm lighter in here. Uh -huh. I'm gonna just push it. Well, I already have gel and stuff on, but look, just already, Whoa. it takes the hole away. It's it's a stain, and I can't even see what I'm doing. No, I see it. Yeah. So you're pushing it into where those holes are, and see how That's it connects it. So that's it. all I need to put on. <laughs> So I basically make it so all of these colors are universal. You can use on any skin tone. You want to be able to have every skin tone covered always. And then the highlighters, my light and tan, same thing. Good for every skin tone, every ethnicity. So this is yeah. darker. Darker complexion, of course. And this is my favorite, my like client's all time favorite. Yeah, I've, so I've, that's the one I use. Yeah, so you, so the other trick too, if you, if you haven't been doing, highlight their brows first and then fill in after. Okay, and you still do the, yep. um, with the brush? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're doing it just like this. Yeah. A little swipe, always flatten it. It has to be nice and flat. Swipe, swipe. And we, we're making our shape. No. So even if there's hair underneath here, this is our brow here, like your grown in hair here, it camouflages it and hides yeah. it, but also connects it all so there's like... Structure. Yes. Yeah, like and and if there's a hole, you can't see the hole. Hides it. Because I have hella holes. No, I, I mean, see how everywhere. You but it, Yeah. But unless I'm showing you and pointing it Nothing out, you don't so, know. It still mm. looks so supernatural. That's the goal. Yeah. Mine are a little f more filled in today. No, but they still look supernatural. Because I was playing with new products, but... Like, this is how I would do, like, a client's brow. Yeah. Nice. And, and, and I leave all of that because when you take if I take it out, it's too done. Uh -huh. You know? It's too perfect. So... I use... Mm. Breakfast for color. Yeah. All right, guys, this is completes my video. I'm getting my Peace eyebrows out. done with Kelly Baker. She killed it. Except for this angle, this is not cute, but whatever. Okay. Hey, guys, so I just finished getting my eyebrows done by Kelly Baker. Came in the sun just to kind of see what they look like, but she killed it. And she gave me a full tutorial on how to do my brows. Honored to even have her touch my face. Honestly, she's so sweet and so dope. Sorry if the video is so short because we're just like catching up on life, especially with everything going on. But she's so amazing. I'm so inspired by her. I, every time I come to get my eyebrows done, I just always feel super inspired by everything that she does. And I mean, like, just look how sick she made my brows. Like, wow, so awesome. I don't know why I said all that with a mask on, but um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video and. Make sure you guys follow Kelly Baker and follow me for more glam adventures. I'll see you guys soon.